uh, vaccination program was put in place for BVD, Lepto, Salmonella and IBR. Uh, that's mainly, that has resulted in very good uh, herd health status. There's been no outbreaks of disease in the farm apart from uh, a TB outbreak in 2011. But uh, in 2011 a decision was taken to close the herd and to purchase no more stock. The replacements are in the herd at this stage. Uh, it has been one of the issues on the farm that would, we haven't been generating enough replacements but there's 126 uh, replacements to calve next year in 2013 and that will straighten, hopefully straighten out a lot of the, the other animal health issues that we have in the farm, such as mastitis and lameness and okay. cow performance. Uh, currently the cows are doing 20 litres at 4.47 fat and 3.47 protein. Uh, cows have lost half a gallon in the last couple of days due to the high rainfall area and low dry matter grass. It looks like performance for the year will be no better than 2011 at 108,000 kilos of milk solids. Uh, nationally kilos of milk solids per cow are around 360 kilos of milk solids so we're ahead of where we were nationally. I would think that for a herd that was put together only two to three years ago performance is satisfactory. Performance is currently being affected by the calving pattern which is not where it should be. Um, today's from first cow calving to median calving date is 43 days and uh, that is not good enough. It needs to be about 20 days or less and that will uh, result in more milk production in the spring which will bring us up to the target kilos and milk solids of 420 per cow. I think uh, come a long way you have as you can see terrific soils, very good grassland all receded, very good uh, labour, uh, very good staff, a uh, lot of monitoring and I would have a lot of confidence that this programme will deliver profit. Uh, the elephant that's out there is probably milk price, they cannot afford to take uh, a milk price of 2009. But, uh, and as you found out below, there was uh, 70,000 euro put away in 2011 and that may be needed yet. But it's a positive development that we will have some surplus cash this year. But I'd say the key message out of here that the farmer should bring home with him is monitoring what he has at home. Be it milk yield, EBI, grass measurement, soil fertility, they're the key messages.